Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Boston College has been on a roll lately, but a winning streak is only important if it continues to be a winning streak. By extending it, we'll see if they can get it done in this one. That does it for us here on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Enjoy the game. We'll see you at the half. It's time for the coin toss now, presented by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Jackson picks up about seven yards on the run. That'll make it second and four. From their own 20-yard line, second down. He's tackled at the 37-yard line. The reason why it's so crucial to be able to run effectively like this is it keeps the defense guessing. They have no idea whether you're passing or running, even if you need medium to long-range yards. Throws quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. This is a well-designed play by the offensive coordinator. Everything really seemed to be working just fine except for the quarterback. He's got to throw a better football. From their own 37-yard line, it's second down. He's taken down. That's the 47. Good, solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. Second and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. And he's taken down at the 45. He got a lot of jersey on that play. Not too much argument about this call. That penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. Second and long. Ball on the 37-yard line. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. They'll spread the field with five wide. made at the 48. Wow, a long game, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt himself. First and second down, so the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Looking for his man, incomplete. This wide receiver is very frustrated. You can tell by his body language. He did everything he needed to do to get open to be able to make a big play. The quarterback just didn't put the ball in the money. From their own 49-yard line, second down. Quick pass. And down he goes at the 44. Game of seven on the play. That makes it third and three.
tackled around the 39-yard line. Brad, you can really feel and sense the energy coming from the sidelines right now. They know how important it is to pick up first downs, and the coaches right now are showing the excitement that they have and yelling out the next play for the offense, but clearly the offensive coordinator very happy about the execution on that last play. Brought down right around the 30. That's good for a gain of nine yards. That'll make it second and inches. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Throws middle to the tight end. They'll bring him down at about the 23-yard line. Seven yards. First down. Hey, 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 hey. He gets out to about the 14-yard line. That's a deep line in the play. That brings up second and one. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. And let's see if the third time's a charm down here in the red zone. He fights forward to about the 13. This is the eighth play of this drive. the first and he stops well the defensive line got such a good push up front that there was no one on the offense to account for the linebacker and he got through almost untouched hands off left and they got him behind the line unable to pick up the first down and the ball will change hands This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. With a quick throw, and this one's broken up. You know, the safety's responsibility, Brad, is to always make sure nothing is going to get behind him. He cannot ever get beat deep. But also, he has a responsibility to step up and make a play on the football in front of him. It's just another example of a defensive back, in this case a safety, just having really good instincts to be able to come up and know when to come up to knock that ball away. Once this guy gets into the secondary, he can be a real problem to bring down. He can shake off a lot of tacklers who are smaller than he is. From the 46-yard line, first down. Tackle right around the 44-yard line. So at the end of one, still no score. Even first quarter as we head into quarter number two. Caught enough for the first down. And he's tackled in the open field. Completes. It's the junior. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. From the 29-yard line, it's first down. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Complete. He's got room. And they make the stop right around the 20. Third down. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. Back in the red zone again, where their three previous trips resulted in zero points each time. Nice run up the middle. Game of six on the play. 
First down. And this play is number eight on the drive. Fires quickly to the tight end. He's got it. Touchdown. some football you bet he can he's such an all-around player he's just as good at in the football with one quarter down i really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads might be neck and neck the whole way boston college is up seven and he's immediately tackled Here's the true test of a quarterback at any level. Can they make a good throw under pressure when one or two or three guys are coming right at him? I think this young passer has proven that, yes, he can. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 36. He's tackled around the 46-yard line. First down. Catch. From the 26 yard line. First down. Mike 56, Mike 56. Set down. Slings it. He's taken down at the 11 yard line. Caught with the tackle at the 11 yard line. That, that makes, makes it first and 10. ten. Him hard at the 11. No that makes it second and 10. ten. From the 11 yard line, second down. Boston College is up a score. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's a game of six on the play. So the offense will come out onto the field to take over once again. They got three points on their last drive, but with this kind of field position, they should be looking to get the ball into the end zone. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Tackled outside after a nice pickup. That's good for a gain of five yards. That'll bring up third and six. Pushed out of bounds at the 16-yard line. Call the gain of six yards. First down. First 
from the 16-yard line. First down. First and goal. That was a really nice play on the ball by the receiver for a substantial gain and a first down. That makes it first and goal. The Eagles had one of their key guys go down earlier, but it looks like he might be able to return. And he's taken down at the two yard line. From the two-yard line, it's second down. Touchdown, Eagles. Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. Throws this one out to the right. And he's got it to the 20. Spectacular play. And now it's first and goal. That's a team 48 on the play. That makes it first and goal. Now it's first and goal with the defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. It's a bad play overall by the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can to be able to make the play work and try to execute. The problem is the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. So here we go. It's third and goal from the two-yard line. And a nice move to finish it off. Touchdown. the offense and I gotta tell you these guys have just been a defensive nightmare on the past few drives he makes his way to about the 28 first down first down 10 yards to go ball on the 28 yard line that's a great tackle at the 39. That's good for a gain of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. field and they finally knock him out at the 36 first down first and 10 ball on the 36 they bring him down Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive linemen and challenges them to start playing a little bit better.
Makes the catch and look out. Tackle made at about the 39-yard line. And we'll take a break while the injured player is attended to. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 26. This quarterback is tough as nails, Brad. He's going to sit in that pocket and give himself a chance. Fourth down. Get out of there and avoid the pressure, or just to throw the ball before you get hit. They are ready to begin another drive. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. That makes it second and eight. From their own 30-yard line, it's second down. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. First down. it left for a decent game. Good for a game of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. And he tackles him hard at the 35. Loss of ten yards on the play. Third down. The Eagles lost a player earlier, and Herbie, this is a big blow to this team. Doesn't look like he's going to play any more football today. Fires it out. And down he goes at the 37-yard line. That makes it first and ten. From the 37 yard line, it's first down. Mike 56, Mike down. 56. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Gaining 11 yards. First down. You like that? You like that? Mike 56, Mike 56. Down. Oh, and he had some steam on that throw. What a play to set him up with a first and goal. That's a game of 21 on the play. That makes it first and goal. Here's the eighth play of the series. Larry, Larry. Mike 56, Mike 56. Nice move, and he scores. Nice job by the offense to get the final few yards to the end. That situation and made it work. drive ended with as good a result as you can hope for and I'm sure they'd like to replicate that here they just seem like they've been in the end zone time and time again there's not much negative you can say about this performance tackled after a decent run up the gut that makes it second and six
Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 26. Boston College with a commanding lead. They keep it to the ground with a tailback. Knackle that for a decent pickup. That's good for a gain of seven yards. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Throwing right. And that one's fallen incomplete. That makes it second and ten. Defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. It's third and ten. Ball on their own 33. Brought down at the 45-yard line. Now, who's the penalty going to be called on here? Pass interference. Offense. They'll give this one another try Still after the down. flag. And on third down, too. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. So with the penalty, they've got third and a mile. Let's it go. Brad, do you imagine being the offensive coordinator right now? Your quarterback is out of sync. He's not making the throw. That makes it fourth and one. Fourth down, and you've got a quarterback and an offense that's struggling. What are you going to do? Both teams are playing out the stretch here. You want to get experience for guys who normally don't get in the game and try to avoid injuries. Boston College looking to build on this commanding lead here. Got him on the screen play. Tackle at the 27. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Second and eight. Ball on the 27-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. And they make the stop at the 38. That makes it first and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. Nash gets a ball left side. And he's tackled at the 50. First down. scrambled they'll bring him down at about the 49 Johnson comes in from the 49 yard line second down well, as they take a look at that injury on the sideline, let's see what this backup can do at quarterback. It's the tailback. He's tackled right around the 38-yard line. First down. From the 38-yard line. First down. Just under three to go in regulation. 
Fires back to the tailback, but he can't bring it in. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, he's got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five-receiver look. And he's sacked. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. They found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. And this play is number eight on the drive. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Under heavy pressure. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. He's taken down at the 34-yard line. That'll make it fourth and six. It's fourth down, and they're going to try to go for it. He's in trouble. And he's going to be sacked. Unable to convert on fourth down, and the ball changes hands. There's a player down. I'm not sure what happened. Well, late in the fourth quarter, this game has been over for a long time, and now we just want to get out of here like these two teams do. Boston College comes to the line, holding that commanding lead. Trying to get it to the tight end, but it falls to the ground. This one was never close today. 31-3, Boston College. And the demon begins. So that wraps things up for us for EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.